Hello everyone. Welcome to Indian Economy by Aman Soni. In this new series called Eco Priority, we would be discussing the important economic concepts for the prelims examination. Let's discuss the topics tax buoyancy. Whenever there is economic growth, it means that the economic activities in the economy are increasing. That will lead to higher income to the people higher income means more taxes to the government that is higher economic growth leads to finally higher tax revenue to the government now tax buoyancy measures the responsiveness of tax revenue growth to the changes in gdp that is to changes in the economic growth without changing the tax rate only when there is increase in growth in the economy how much more revenue is the government getting that is tax buoyancy i repeat again without changing the tax rates when there is growth in the economy that is when the gdp is increasing how much more revenue the government is getting that is because of which taxes the government is getting more revenue those taxes are said to be buoyant thus tax revenue growth sensitivity are measured in tax buoyancy so a tax is said to be buoyant when tax revenues increase more than proportionately in response to rise in national income or output the gdp increased by 10% at this level at a level of gdp government was getting x percentage of taxes when gdp increased by 10% the revenue increases by say x plus 12% here the taxes are increasing more by 2% without changing any tax revenue those taxes are said to be buoyant so tax buoyancy measures the efficiency and responsiveness and the mobilization ability of the government in taxes that is how well can the government collect taxes without changing the tax rates when the economy is improving generally it is said that direct taxes are more sensitive to gdp growth because when there is too much growth the rich people get comparatively more income so they also fall in the uh, higher tax bracket because of the progressive taxation so the taxes that these rich people would be paying to the government would also comparatively proportionately increased compared to the earlier levels of income this is about tax buoyancy tax buoyancy is nothing but without changing the tax rate how much more taxes is the government revenue the government revenue is generated without changing in tax rate a related concept is tax elasticity here it refers to the changes in tax revenue in response to the tax rate change tax buoyancy was about revenue and growth here what is a change in tax revenue when the tax rate is changed here let's look at the laffer's curve the laffer's curve says that at 0% tax rate the government revenue also would be zero because it is not getting any income at 100% tax rate also the tax revenue would be zero because no would be, nobody would be willing to work because whatever you work and you get the income everything the government is taking away so he says that the ideal tax rate is somewhere in between where near the peak that this ideal tax rate would generate more income to the government because anything beyond this people won't be willing to work because whatever you work and get the government is taking away from you in form of taxes below this as we move to the left the government is getting less and less revenue so laffer's curve exp uh, expresses the relationship between tax revenue and tax rate 
tax elasticity measures the changes in tax revenue because of changes in tax rate take example of sin goods even if the government increases taxes on alcohol the person who is going to drink alcohol suddenly he is not going to decrease his consumption so these are called inelastic taxes because even if the tax rate is changed there won't be any change in the revenue that is generated from those sin goods and elastic taxes are those which will lead to either increase or decrease in the tax revenue say the government reduces the corporate tax from 30% to 25% this can encourage the corporates to invest more in the economy again this will lead to multiplier effect finally the government can get more taxes compared to what it was getting previously this is tax elasticity thank you